Hi ladies, get your hands out of your pockets, make some noise, clap in time, sing along if you feel that way inclined. Now when she first entered this tournament, she entered in disguise as her late father, but she's proved herself at the list and has had royal approval to compete here today in her own right as a female. I can tell you that she's fiercely loyal to our king. Welcome. And well met to you, my lady. And so, my lady, is our Frenchman, Lord Philippe of Aragon, in the orange and burgundy. I can tell you that this knight is fiercely opposed to our king, so what do you say to that, my lords and ladies? Uh, bonjour, monsieur. He is the winner of the Christ and Power, apparently playing Adam the Black Knight in today's tournament. From her and her, her it is. Sir William Thatcher, my lords and ladies, in the blue and the yellow. It is a fearless knight who, when he entered this tournament, had but barely a suit of armour to his name, but his lady drew to today's final. He is the secret of serenity. It is, of course, Black Animal, the Black Knight! A fearless champion who will stop at nothing to be victorious. Some say he is a treacherous villain. The master of three companies, the high champion of the lack of is Lady Thomas Colville. She's followed by a healthy very own Sir William Thatcher in the blue and the yellow. Usually does. It is called Adamar the Black Knight. Now remember, you delight each other with my lady. And we're fair this time. Come on now, my lords and ladies, raise your voices for them. Well, next up it is the local boy in the blue and the yellow. I might be striking that quintain with ease there. Well done, nice right with yourself there. Well played, Lady Colville. Lord Philippe. A mighty no points dropped. Oh, a mighty point. Well played. Come on, my lords. Oh, bad luck, Pat Adamar. But Sir William. How are they fair? Oh, nothing for me the night there. Bad luck, my lord. Bad luck, my lady. Perhaps you weren't cheering loud enough for them. I wonder who you're cheering for. Oh, up against the reigning champion. Oh, Count Adamar! Game! Each time you strike your opponent between the neck and the waist, I shall be awarding two points for a blow to your opponent's helm or indeed of his helm. And I shall be awarding a maximum three points should you unhorse your rail. In an act of chivalry, displaying their banners there, accepting the rules of. Let us find find strike there by the reigning champion, resulting in a broken lance there, but it's a point for a strike too. That should, and indeed our ladies, who are you cheering for? Let them hear you. A mighty fine strike there by the reigning champion, Pat Adamar. Well played, my lord. Oh, and another fine strike, resulting in the removal of the head. Both of our knights there, passing along that tilt there, once more displaying their banners. Accepting the rules of the dice. Oh, a mighty point strike there by the Frenchman. Well played. Lord Philippe, a point going to you. Oh, come, come now, my lord. It is a contact sport. We wish to see more contact from you. Here they come once more. Oh, a fine strike there by Sir William. Keenly coming up against that tilt rail. Against the Frenchman there. Oh! Oh, Sir William! At the tilt rail. Well, as I say now, my lords and ladies, the scores are too close to call at this stage. I'm going to need some time to work out those scores. Please be patient. We will return your favours to you as flyers that make their way back around the arena.